The National Zoological Institute is located about 19 kilometers from central Havana and is 342 hectares in size. Its mission is to contribute to environmental awareness and to carry out research in the reproduction of highly valued endangered species. It employs a total of 575 workers, which include PhD holders, doctors, veterinarians and animal nutrition specialists. The National Zoo of Cuba is also home to the 144 wildlife animals donated to Cuba by Namibia. A donation that had tongues wagging both inside and outside of Namibia. However, Cuba's new ambassador to Namibia, Geraldo Masola, says the animals are in fine shape and so far had produced offspring totaling 62. Ambassador Masola arrived in Namibia two weeks ago. I see the animals as a gesture, as a gesture of love, uh, as a way to, to express the love and the gratitude to my people, which is what I see to those animals. Namibia is not a rich country. But uh, he won't, decided to share with us something that you have here. He said yes to and we appreciate that as that. The Cuban diplomat who arrived in Namibia in the midst of the election campaign has commended Namibians for having conducted elections in a peaceful and credible environment. But anyway, it was, had to be recognized by everybody that the situation of the election here was so quiet, so calm. Even I make a tour around window to see the and I don't see a single police in any place. Just uh, people very quiet in the queues with umbrellas because the sun that day was yeah. strong. Yeah. But everything quiet. And the results were uh, absolutely fabulous, really. Ambassador Mazzola previously served in Chile in Latin America.